So the Meisters govern Stonebridge? Are they nobility? Nobility? Far from it. They're the richest men in the city. Merchants, bankers, bureaucrats. Stonebridge calls itself a republic now. Ever since the old king died, and the people drove out the last Lord Mayor. Any idea where I can find the Meisters? Probably at the old mayoral office, on the main square. I'm told it was converted into a great public hall where the Meisters hold court. Jane is probably besieging the mines by now. The Meisters can wait. Up to you. Martin and I will trust in your decision, and we'll be here if you need us. Talk to some old family friends. Spread the word that the legions returned. Half a minute there. You came from the chapter house, did you not? Tell me, is it true? Has the Legion returned? Only a few of us. But yes, we've reclaimed the old chapter house. Ha! Let them laugh at me now. Meister Wolf, with his silly dreams of radiant children and prophecies of the Legion's return. Are any Legionnaires still living in Stonebridge? I'm sorry, but I'm afraid not. Jane and her mobs were quite thorough. That whole affair was a mark of shame upon our city. Be assured that I took no part in that travesty, nor did my father or anyone else who bears the name Wolf. I'm here to address the Meisters. We want to propose an alliance against Jane Cassinder. An alliance? That'll be tricky business. I can force them to give you a hearing, at least. I'll warn you, though, they're scared. Scared of Jane Cassinda and her armies. Scared that we'll lose our Republic if she takes the city by force. And scared of other things, too.
The Meisters are scared of something else. Something inside the city? No, forget I spoke of it. The other Meisters will know you've been talking to Mad Old Wolf with his secrets and conspiracies, and that won't win you any friends on the Council. I'm ready to address the Meisters. Capital! I shall go on ahead and announce you. We'll await you inside. Gentlemen and goblins, order! Council recognizes the envoy from the Tenth Legion. Meister Wolf tells us that you propose an alliance. A grave matter indeed. Perhaps our colleague forgot to emphasize how deeply we value our neutrality. A war with Jane Cassinder would risk the very life of our Republic. What do we gain by siding with the Legion? For 30 years we've known nothing but civil war. Help us bring order to Ebb. We were one people, one nation. We can be so again. A chance to redeem our city's name. An honorable cause to take. Nonetheless, you can understand why some in the city might fear the Legion's return. Countless Legionnaires were murdered in our streets. People might think that you've come to seek revenge. Forget the past. Those murders are 30 years gone. We came here to reconcile. Not for revenge. Words alone are unlikely to sway our good citizens. But perhaps if we form a committee, study the problem for several months or a year. Nonsense! The Legion is no threat. There's far more dangerous things in this city if you would only open your eyes. Ah, our colleague again speaks of the dapper old gent, no doubt. Indeed, sir, I do. You think that the trouble in the foundry is not the work of the gent? The gent? Who is he? Our nemesis. Our tormentor. His retribution in mortal guise. Uh, Meister Wolf, let us not turn aside from the matter at hand. We owe the Legion our vote. No, wait. That hardly seems fair. Force a vote now, and it will assuredly go against the Legion. I propose a recess. Let us each speak privately to the Legionnaires, so that we can reach an informed and impartial judgment. Sounds like a reasonable idea. We agree. Indeed, well spoken, Meister Mudgutter. Any objections? None? Council declares a recess. We shall reconvene after the Legion Envoy has spoken to each of my esteemed colleagues, and all are prepared to render a judgment. Greetings, Legionnaire. If you've come to win my vote, don't bother. My mind is made up. Stonebridge will have no entangling alliances. So that's that. Now, if you need some little task to occupy your time, or if you have a question, perhaps I can be of service. Are you sure there's nothing we can do to win your vote? At the moment, no. But worry not. I'm sure the other Meisters will vote for you if you sate their self-interested needs. Now, I do have a task or two for you. It's not going to win over my vote, but I would find a way to repay your efforts. Long ago, the Legion served as the mediator of first and last resort. When an argument ran out of control, the Legion offered counsel. That's all? I thought you might have wanted us to slay something for you. Your first task is to handle a situation with a prisoner of ours, a Krug. 
He has no crimes charged against him, but his fate is disputed. Many argue he's safer in prison. Others want him free. He's here in the Meister Hall's jail. Make your inquiries there, then tell the automaton who presides over the jail what you've decided. <laughs> it's hardly dragon slaying, but if you're true to the Legion, you'll have time for small matters. Go on now, I've got work to do. Ah, uh, yes. I was wondering when you'd come and harass me. No doubt you're here to solicit my vote for your organization. You could at least offer me a proper introduction. Oh, yes. Trivialities. I'm Lord Barrister Mudgutter, Director of the Office of Contracts and Patents, Chief Magistrate of Stonebridge. And I have some other random titles with capital letters. I think I'm technically the High Marshal of Top Fermenting Beverages. Then I trust you're the goblin to talk to if I want the Meister's support. One of them, yes. I think you'll find that Wolf is very much smitten with the romantic notion of the Legion. The rest of us... need convincing. How can the Legion earn your vote? Well, you could help me alphabetize court documents. But a better use of your talents would be to help me with an investigation. Normally, I'd have Wolf handle the situation, but it happens to involve a sizable degree of danger, and Wolf is too important to risk. If this is the price for your support, I accept. Just tell me what you need. So, the matter at hand. We've had numerous reports of masked individuals hauling automatons into the crypts under the city. Whatever their aim, they are slowly eroding our defenses, and that is intolerable, especially with Jane Cassinder and her army on the loose. If someone was to mm, enter the crypts and purge them of these criminals, I would owe that person a favor. Consider it done. We'll be back when we've dealt with these criminals. Well then, if you keep your word, I shall do the same, and cast my vote in support of the Legion. Good day.